Greetings, my fellow adventurers, and welcome back to Let's Play Gothic 1 with me, Captain Green Bear. My apologies for what happened late. Well, not last night, but uh, at the end of the last set, which was actually early last morning. Uh, the thing is, I was quite wary of the whole adventure in the free mine. I didn't want to equip the wrong sword, but this is the best one that I have, yes. Um, so I didn't really know how to defeat that bloody troll up in the northern mountains. I couldn't quite think of anything. I needed that one spell and I couldn't remember where I could get it from. So, obviously, the most logical thing to do is to seek knowledge from the most powerful wizard that we know. And who is that, you might ask? It's obviously bloody well the necromancer pretending to be Zardus. So that is where we're going today. I think I unequipped the spell in the process of slaughtering my way through the free mine. So let's head over to the necromancer and see whether he has the spell that I need. Ah, yes, yes. This is the tower of the necromancer. I remember it well. And here is the bloody letter. And one of the messengers hanging on the wall. How you doing, Barry? He's not very talkative. I don't think he likes me. Alright. <clears throat> oh, great necromancer! I seek your knowledge and your items. I'm seeking magic knowledge. Hey, there we go. Uh, he has a summon demon scroll that might be useful, but I'm, I'm not sure my character is the type of person to summon demons. So let's just ignore that for now. Fireball we already have, I think. At least some scrolls. Summon skeleton. Uh, I'm not too fond of undead, actually. I wouldn't say I'm scared of them, but rather it's, you know, it, it's it's unnatural. I, I, I don't need to argue with you about this. It's just my personal opinion. Uh, summon golem. That might come in handy. Uh, let's let's put one. Oh, he actually has only one. Uh, oh, shrink monster. There we go. One thousand. That's quite a lot. You only need one. I hope. Uh, we already had this. He somehow rearranged his inventory for some reason. There's another rune here. Death to the undead. Oh, it's the fourth circle. I was just going to say that sounds neat. But I think I'm only circle three. Mm, might check that out in a second. Costs only five mana. That's awesome. And does almost 10,000 damage to undead. Whew. Fourth circle, eh? You know what? I'll buy that. Fourth circle. That might be worth it. Okay. So, obviously, we have gotten a lot, uh, a lot of stuff, a lot of loot from freeing the free mine. And I don't want to bother you with going through selling all this and comparing which I might want to keep. So, I'm just uh, speeding things up here. Enjoy! Yeah, oh, bloody hell. I didn't pay attention. Uh, no, I gave him goods for... 7,600, that's, that is not, no, no, we can't do that, Zardus, and you don't really have all that many um, items in your inventory, uh, so, um, give me another shrink monster, and, uh, yeah, some demons, why not, sounds good, I mean, it's not like you have much else, uh, also, I will get all of these, and, uh, summon, all your skeletons, I suppose. Can't really see the number. I think it's four. So if I get another one, no, no, this is fine. I'll, I'll give you the extra two hundred. I'm not that good at math, 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 mathematics. Ah, uh, so we'll, we'll do that. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Necromancer. Yep, I'll happily accept this trade. Thank you very much, Zardes. Now I can go and slay the last bloody troll. Uh, how do I do that? Which is the quickest way to the troll? Hmm. Probably... 
probably to the water majors again, eh? No, there's my magic. There we go. Uh, this I'll unequip as well as meat pock. And what is this? Chain light? Oh yeah, I'll make it that. Uh, where are the water mages? There. It's on five now. Okay. Uh, which which um, circle am I? I am circle. Uh, where is it? Circle 3, alright, but I have 15 skill points, I think I need 20 for Circle 4. So, remember to kill all the animals on the way to the troll. Yeah, I will do that. There was a time when I led a very different life. I was one of the best generals of this country. I've spent my whole life fighting for my country. But the nobles didn't like me because the king listened to my advice and they knew I posed a threat to their dirty business. I hadn't counted on their insidiousness. They used the king's wife to get me. I was blamed for her pointless murder. King Robar had no other choice. The services I had rendered my country saved me from the gallows, but they robbed me of my freedom. One day I'll be free again then I shall return and take revenge. I shall have my revenge. Uh, cool story, bro. Uh, I'm just going, alright? Huh, bye. Weirdo. These mercenaries. They're completely loonies. That was just odd, don't you think? Seriously, if someone just stops you in the middle of the street and, and, and tells you their whole life story, that's kind of odd, isn't it? Or is that just me? In any case. <sighs> yeah, so, <clears throat> shrinking the troll, then we should have all the items now we need f to build the Ulumulu. So we'll head over to the free mine once more. And no, by then we should have enough skill points to advance to the to the fourth circle. And then we should be able to defeat any undead, which which is which is just awesome. I'm very much looking forward to that, because I hate undead. Awful existences. Ooh. So, in any case, it's uh, December now, uh, which means it's almost Christmas. And admittedly, I didn't come up with a wish list uh, just yet, what I wish for, for Christmas. Um, I have a few things that I would like that I think would improve my, my life. For example, new headset and microphone. Uh, that would definitely make things easier for me. But uh, then again, I don't really want to wish for it from my family because um, they, they are not that good with technical stuff and I'm kind of afraid that they will just buy anything that the salesman will tell them is good and then I'm well at the same quality level as before or worse so what am I searching for right shrink equip shrink do a save and have at you no wait which one was it yeah this one all right Bloody troll, I'll kill you in the rain. Uh, okay, can I? There we go. <laughs> oh, I just think it's so funny. And there's no Diego here now to kill it. Oh, lovely, 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 lovely. <laughs> I can't even push it. Oh, little one. I wish I could burst. Put you in my pocket. Show you to my friends. My, my friends are uh, being Milton and Lester and, and others. Where are you going? Are you trying to run away? Is he afraid of me? Is he really trying to run away? Oh, you can't go. 
the little one. Let's cut off his height. Or his tusks. Yeah, I can't I can't take heights, I remember. Alright, we got that. We got that. Maybe there's an update now in my in my Ulumulu uh, section. No. Uh, no. Well, I, th I, I hope I have all of them now. So are heading for the swamp camp now first to increase my circle. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Get the circle first and then head over back to Tarok and get the Ulumulu done. That's what I'm going to do. Hello everyone. Yeah, I still haven't shaved, shaved my hair. I don't really want to do that. Yeah, we could stop by for tuna. I think we have a few minutes. That's alright. It's not like we're on urgent business or anything. You don't need to keep things cool, you know. Chill out from time to time. Hey, Fortuna. Awaken! How are things going? I've come to collect my daily ration. Here, take it! Thanks. Thanks, Fortuna. Alright. Uh, no, I actually don't want to get into the rain. I'm just staying here. <laughs> There we go. As promised, no more silly effects. I don't want to scare you, but I'm getting the munchies. I need to eat something. Haven't eaten anything in days. Body healing can't take away that lovely taste for cheese and meat. And what's this? Minecraft soup? Yeah, whatever. I'll just eat it. Mm. Lovely. Oh, what's this? Life bonus. Mountain moss. I have only one of those. I wonder what it tastes like. It tastes like heaven and I had only one of it. Ah, bloody hell. Alright. Let's go. Rain is gone. And let's head over to Bal Kadar, I think his name was. The guy who already invited us to the first three circles. We should be happy. Awaken! That we make so much progress. Um, yes, yes, I am! Teach me, master! 